Turning now to the coronavirus pandemic, passengers on a carnival cruise that left Miami are in quarantine across the country after a COVID outbreak. They were moved into isolation in local hotels after the ship docked in Seattle. And tonight, we're hearing from one of the passengers who tested positive. Overwhelmed at sea, that's how some passengers aboard Carnival's Spirit cruise ship described staff upon learning of a COVID outbreak. I've been on seven cruises since August. And of course, COVID is always a concern. Darren Seifertson was among those who tested positive. I literally stayed in this room for six days with no telephone service. They wouldn't answer the phone. Seifertson says his travel companion and roommate stayed with him in the room despite testing negative and that a list of passengers' names and cabin numbers of those who had contracted the virus was posted near elevators. The outbreak occurred during the ship's voyage between Miami, where it departed last month, and Seattle, where it arrived on Tuesday. Upon docking, all infected passengers were moved to area hotels for isolation. Carnival refused to say how many of its approximately 2,100 passengers tested positive, but insists travelers were vaccinated and tested before boarding. And in a statement to CBS News, said in part, quote, our health and safety protocols exceed CDC guidelines and additional measures were implemented during the voyage. But that brings little comfort to passengers like Seifertson. Unfortunately, this ship was so unprepared and so mismanaged that many of us suffered greatly. And coming up at 6, we'll hear from a travel agent about what you need to know and do if you're considering a summer cruise.